Who could that be? Who's at the door, Mommy? Hello? Oh, oh. Hello. I'm from the military, and I have some terrible news to share with you What's your husband. Mommy, what's going on? We're so sorry. He fought bravely and did everything he could do to save the kingdom. Mommy, what's wrong? Why are you crying? Oh, oh, Granny, it's okay. Just go, go to your room. So, that's how your dad died? Yep. All because of the stupid war. <sighs> My dad died in the war, too. Looks like we got that in common. And after my mom passed away, I lived with my Uncle Axe. Axe said that he'd watch over me. Well, at least you have family. After my mom died, I got sent to an orphanage. <sighs> That's why we always have to stick together, friend. We have to watch each other's backs, no matter what. Sounds good to me. You're all that I have. We have to look out for each other. All right. Well then, let's make a promise. A promise? What kind of promise? Let's promise to always be there for each other, no matter what. Let's promise to work together to make Abaddon a better place to live. Can you promise me that, friend? You and me will face this rotten world together, side by side. Deal? Deal! Episode 19, The Final Showdown Grimmy, I know you're in there. You said we'd always watch out for each other. Remember our promise. <sighs> Grimmy's soul is mine now. And soon I will devour all your souls too. <sighs> no, Grimmy. We have to fight back! Don't let him control you, friend! Uh, rascal! Friend! Help me! I'm sorry! I'm ah, sorry. Shut up, you fool! Your soul is mine now! Together we're a god! Let him go! <sighs> Never! He made his decision, and now that we're together, we're more powerful than ever! And not even that blasted fox can stop us now. <sighs> oh yeah? Not if I have anything to say about it. Sheila! Grace! What? You? Who are you? Where's that blasted fox? He sent me in his place. Now leave these animals alone. <sighs> Coward! He doesn't even have the courage to fight his own battles! Give it up, Shaitan. You're outnumbered. Ah, never! You are all worthless mortals! That blasted fox is a coward! Maybe he is, but we're not. And you're gonna pay for what you did. You silly mortals don't stand a chance against me. Oh yeah? You wanna see about that? Whoa! Who's that gal? I don't know, but I like her. Hey wait, isn't that the gal we locked up? Oh yeah, but now she's on our side, right? Shut up you stupid imbeciles. Even now you two are incompetent. <sighs> they are more competent than you are, Shaitan. Because we all fight together as one. And you can't stop all of us. Well, I'll be. I like this newfound confidence, Sheila. And there's something different about her now. But I just can't put my finger on it. Maybe she found some more cookies. That always makes me confident. So, Shaitan, what's it gonna be? You can either surrender now or face our fury. Ha <laughs> ha! You all don't scare me. I'm immortal now. Really? 
You want to put that to a test? All right, everyone. Let's get ready to battle. Rascal? What's he doing here? It's all right, Sheila. He's okay. He's been helping us fight off Shaitan. Wait, seriously? Yeah. He saved our lives multiple times already. We can trust him. Well, I don't know. But I guess Whitey did say I had to trust my allies. I just hope he wasn't lying. Oh, how sentimental. Enemies coming together to fight his allies. Shut up, you monster! Now let my friend go! Ah! <sighs> or what? What are you going to do about silly mortal? We are going to end you! <sighs> I'd like to see you try. Well then, if that's the way you want it, let's finish this. What's going on? He's a bloody dragon now? No more playing around! Time to die! Everybody! This is it! It's do or die! Alright Adam, it's now or never. Attack! Haha, <gasps> ah! <laughs> you think you can stop me? <laughs> Shut up you big meanie! Oh my! Oh, yeah. Yeah. Stupid mortals! Get off me! Watch out! Ah! Uh -huh. <sighs> Get off me! What do you think you're doing? Um, saving your life? Well, I don't need you to save my life! Get out of my way! I'm just trying to help! You can help by trying to figure out how to kill Shaitan. I think I have a plan, but we'll need to get to his eyes, and we'll need a distraction. Well, I can help with the eye part. Climb on me back, Sheila. Okay, now we just need a good distraction. Hey, watch out! <laughs> what the blazes? Crikey, that was a close one. Yeah, talk about a hot pursuit. You mortals! You guys run ahead! I'll distract him! Remember the plan! Alright, Chaitan! It's just you and me! Let my friend go! Never! By the fires within me, you will all burn to ash! Alright! What do you do? Me have an idea? Hiya! <sighs> what the heck? <sighs> Whoa! Where'd that beehive come from? Me hid it in me helmet. So you've been carrying a random beehive around this whole time? Yep. Me put it in there in case me get hungry. Whoa! Nice work, mate. <sighs> Stupid bees! Get off me! <sighs> Brown Spot said to always be ready. Enough sweet talk. Time to attack while he's distracted. Let's go. Haha. <laughs> sweet talk. <laughs> Stupid bees. <laughs> All right, Sheila. Get on me back. Hold on tight. Um, are you sure you know what you're doing? Yeah. It's just like stump jumping. Now hold on. Yeah. Yeah. I'll carry this to his eyes! Hiya! Hiya! Enough! <sighs> <sighs> Don't think you can win that easily! Now you two will die! Ugh. Sheila, are you okay? Your precious Sheila is as good as dead! <sighs> Prepare to feel the wrath of God! Grimmy! You have to fight back! Look at what you're doing! Shut up, worthless mortal. I've heard enough out of you. Oh, rascal. Friend. Attack. I'll hold him back. Huh? Grimmy? Grimmy, is that you? Yes. Now stab his eyes. I'll try and slow him down. But what about you? Won't that kill you too? 
Don't worry about me, friend. It's the only way. Besides, remember our promise. Please free me of this curse, friend. I've always looked after you, friend. This is how you can repay me. But I don't want to hurt you. You won't hurt me, friend. You'll set me free. Ha ha ha! Don't be naive. You're too weak to defeat me. Don't listen to him, friend. You can do it. I believe in you. Now be brave and finish this job. Okay, Grimmy. Let's save Abaddon. Yeah. <sighs> Charge the big meanie. I move! Rascal, I'll hold him back, friend. Deliver the final blow! Got it! Take this, you big meanie! Ah, knock it off, you stupid bear! Hi-ya! Rascal, hurry! I can't hold him much longer! Hi-ya! Hi-ya! Take this, Shaitan! Hi-ya! 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 I don't get it! Why isn't he going down? Those puny weapons can't hurt me! I'm the god of this world! Sheila, wake up! We gotta go! Now! <laughs> you actually thought that Grimmy could stop me? Well, you all are deathly mistaken! <laughs> Grimmy is too weak to hold me back! Now who should I kill first? <laughs> I'll start with the bear that threw bees at me. <laughs> Sheila, get up! Knox in trouble! Grace, it's time to get up. You must protect your friends. <laughs> oh no! Don't worry! I'll save you! Grace, the moment has come. The only way to defeat Shaitan is to stab his eyes with my soul. And I am in your sword. So use the sword and stab his eyes, Grace. And put an end to him. Open your eyes, sis, and save Abaddon! <laughs> Sheila, you're awake! Yes, I am, Jack. And now, I'm going to put an end to this. <laughs> Don't worry, Knock. I'm coming. Stay away from Knock, you monster. <laughs> no, you're not going to hurt Knock. Don't worry, I'll save you. Okay, Grace. Make sure to visualize and attack. Remember what Brown Spot taught us. Don't worry. I'll save you! Ah! <laughs> Nobody hurts my knock! Visualize and attack! Visualize and attack! <laughs> Come on, Grace. You got this, sis. Hiya! You fools! How could this happen? What's going on? I'm... I'm... <sighs> Whoa! That was nuts! Did someone say nuts? Me still hungry! You okay, Sheila? <sighs> <sighs> yeah, I think so. Knock, are you okay? Yeah, me fine. Waskell saved me. Oh, thank goodness you're okay. Where is Rascal? <coughs> oh my god, Rascal! Oh no! <coughs> Rascal, Rascal, are you okay? Yeah, I'll be fine. Did we win? 
Yeah, thanks to you, you saved us. <coughs> That's good. But what about you? You're bleeding. Yeah, I guess I am. Why did you do that? Why did you jump in front of Shaitan? I wanted to do the right thing. I knew it was the only way. <coughs> now you're dying. Help! Help! Anyone, help! Listen. <coughs> Don't worry about me. I'll be okay. Go on. Live your life. Be free of Shaitan. But what about you? I don't want you to die. <coughs> oh, don't worry. For the first time in my life, <coughs> I'm happy. I know I did the right thing. And I'll get to see Grimmy again. The real Grimmy. We can finally be together and be happy. What? What happened to me? Where am I? Oh! Why, hello, old friend. <laughs> what? You? What happened to my voice? What did you do to me? Oh, I didn't do anything to you. You did this to yourself. <sighs> Where am I? What is this place? Oh, this is our new home. What do you think? Roomy, isn't it? But how? How'd I end up here? <laughs> well, you lost the game. Now you're trapped here with me. Forever! <laughs> oh boy, we're gonna have such a good time. Think of all the chess we could play. Oh, and you have to try the tea I made. It's delightful! But this isn't fair. How did this happen? I was supposed to be God! <laughs> you? God? <laughs> you know... With jokes like that, we're going to get along just fine. But I don't get it. I possess Grimmy's soul. How could he fight back like that? I was supposed to be the most powerful being in the universe. <sighs> you? The most powerful being in the universe? <laughs> oh, come now. You couldn't even control Grimmy. You couldn't even beat a couple of kids. How dare you? You're just a coward! Who do you think you are? Huh? Who am I? Interesting question. I guess you don't remember, do you? I am I you, am you, and you are me. I am I all am that one that can one see. Can see. I, am I am who I am, am and always I will be. be. But you but can you simply can call me, me Waiting. Wait. Don't you worry, you'll have all eternity to figure it out. It'll be just like old times, before I released you into the world. You know, I did have high hopes for you back then. I thought maybe there was a chance that you could take my spot. But I guess I can't be right all of the time, now can I? <sighs> no! You can't do this to me! I'll find a way to defeat you! You were supposed to pay for Lockerbie and that sword. This isn't the end. You'll pay for this. No, uh, that isn't going to work for me. You know, if we're going to spend all eternity together, we have to get along better than this. So, uh, here you go. Yeah, now that's better. Oh no! What'd you do to me? What'd you do to me? Oh no! Get out of here! I'll... Ah, you know, you make a pretty good 
ornament, don't you? <laughs> yep. I think I'll just set you right here. Ah, good tea. Now, right to my chess game. Whoa, I didn't expect that. Is Shaitan, you know, dead? Yeah, I think we finally killed him. Dad Coon saved me wife. Wife? You're too young to have a wife. No, not wife. Wife! Um, I'm confused. Ah, never mind, mate. Anyway, that stinks about Rascal. He turned out to be a decent fella after all. He saved our lives. We'll have to give him a proper burial. He was a hero. <sighs> he sure was. Is everyone else okay? Yeah, we're fine. Just a few cuts and bruises. X seems to beat us up worse than that. We'll be fine, as long as we're all safe. Okay, let's get everyone bandaged up. Do you think now things will go back to normal? <sighs> Sadly, I don't think things will ever go back to normal. But if we work together, we can at least make things better. You know, Sheila, I can't believe this is finally over. I still remember when I asked you and Adam to come to Abaddon. You did it, Sheila. You saved me kin. Because of you, me bro and mama are safe. No, Jack. We did it. We couldn't have done any of this alone. This was a team victory. But what about everyone we lost? Yes, we all lost so much in this war. But... I've learned that just because someone dies doesn't mean they're gone. They live forever in our hearts, and we must never forget them, for their bravery is what helped us save Abaddon. Will Shaitan ever come back? As long as we stick together, we should never have to worry, for I've learned that together we are stronger than any evil that faces us. And together, we can rebuild Abaddon. All right, Sheila. Let's do it. If we're rebuilding something, can we please get more food places? Me been hungry this whole time. Okay, Nak. We'll make sure you have plenty of places to go to eat. Promise? Promise. Hey, Grundo, look what I found. Looks like a piece of paper to me. No, idiot. Look what's on the paper. Oh, wow. It's a recipe for banana chocolate chip cookies. Yeah, those sound delicious. I wonder why I never thought of that. Because you're an idiot, that's why. Will you two bozos quit your bullet bread and tell me if the sign looks good? Hmm, looks good to me. Ah, uh, yeah. I guess it'll work. What's the sign for? I'm gonna open up this tea shop. And do what with it? Sell tea, of course. A tea shop, huh? Hey, you think we can sell those banana chocolate chip cookies at the tea shop? Huh, well, actually it's not a bad idea. Hey, now I recognize you. Aren't you that deer that likes bananas? Huh, boy. Nothing gets by you. Since we found the recipe, we should partner up with the shop. So, uh, you two are going to work for me at the shop? Yeah, it's okay with you. Oh yeah, that sounds like a splendid idea. 
Business will bloom for sure. Oh, sounds great. <sighs> now, little ones, careful now. Susie, don't write on the walls. Lemon, get off the cabinets. Lucy, what are I say? Ah, they don't listen. Haha, <laughs> would you like a hand? You seem a bit overwhelmed. Yeah, I didn't think reopening the daycare would be this hard. I mean, taking care of Scooter and Jack when they were young was tough, but this... This is just impossible! I can only imagine. And now, you have little knock as well. Yeah, except he's not so little. Well... I'm sure his new older brothers can help watch over him. A little? But Scooter's opening up the tea shop, and Jack's going to become a knight. I mean, I'm proud of all of them, but I could show you some help around here. I just find it wonderful that you are reopening the daycare. Because of you, Mrs. Crackler's legacy will live on. And I think it's wonderful that you've adopted Nock. Jack and Scooter are going to be great big brothers to him. <sighs> yeah, I just hope I can manage. Lemon, Lemon get off of there! Well, you know you always have my help. And plus, I have a surprise for you! Surprise? Let's play nice now. They're there now. Hi there, we're here to help. What is all this? They're all volunteers, and they love kids, and you don't even have to pay them. They just wanted to help out. Aww, you're so adorable. Paint on the paper, not the walls. <laughs> oh my gosh, you're a saint. Bless your heart. No, you're the saint for reopening Mrs. Quacker's daycare. Oh, you're going to make it a wonderful clean. Are you sure? Of course! Who better than you to lead Abaddon? So, are you excited for coronation tomorrow? I suppose. Are you nervous? Um, yeah, I am a little nervous. But I know I have my friends to help me. We'll work together to make Abaddon great again. I know you will. All of Abaddon believes in you. We did it, mate. We're Knights of Abaddon. Yeah, me a knight, and me even scared of the dark. <laughs> well, mate, no we need to be scared of the dark anymore. Me no, me a ninja bear now, and ninja bears are not afraid of nothing. Yeah, got that right, mate. Attention, everyone. Please welcome the Queen of Abaddon. Listen, everyone. Listen. I may be your queen, but I couldn't have done any of this without you. We're all in this together. And I want to thank all of you for helping to rebuild Abaddon. It's even more beautiful than when I first got here. I should be hailing all of you. Our queen has spoken. Oh, oh, hey, oh, oh queen, 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 queen. queen. <laughs> well done, Sheila. Thanks, Jack. So, 
What now, your highness? I guess we just keep moving forward, one day at a time, and rebuild. Well, Adam, we did it. We saved Abaddon. We became the heroes, just like you wanted. Nock and Jack are Knights of Abaddon. I'm the Queen. Nock and Scooter and Jack are brothers now. Huh, they're like peas in a pod. And bless their mother, bless her heart. She took over Mrs. Quacker's daycare. Everything is slowly getting back to normal. The citizens of Abaddon have been wonderful. Everyone has been helping out. We've been rebuilding the cities, and there's no more war. The kingdoms are finally working together. This tragedy has brought everyone together. Everything is slowly getting better. But there still isn't a day that goes by that I don't think of you, bro. I miss you so much. I know you told me to be strong, and that we'll always be together no matter what, but it's still hard. I just wish you were here. Alright, just this way, sir. Please show me a sign that you're okay. Anything to know that you're still around? Um, excuse me, your highness? Oh, Jack, you know you don't have to call me that. Oh, uh, sorry, Sheila, but, um, hey, there's someone that would like to see ya. Huh? Hi, Grace. Mr. Scruffles? How did you get here? Adam led me here. Adam? Yeah, I met Adam's spirit in the woods. He led me to this weird temple and explained everything to me. And then he disappeared. I'm so sorry for everything, Grace, for how I treated you and Adam. I know now just how much the two of you mean to me. I'm so incredibly sorry, Grace. You mean the world to me, and I was an idiot. I should have never let my drinking get the better of me. I guess I have an inner demon, Grace. But I'm willing to spend the rest of my life making it up to you. I'm sorry. Can you ever forgive me? You know, Dad, my time in Abaddon has taught me a lot of things. We all have our inner demons, Dad. But everyone deserves a second chance. We just have to keep fighting. Dad? Did you just call me Dad? Well, you did adopt us, didn't you? So, does that mean you forgive me? Well, does this answer your question? <laughs> <laughs>